inside the warehouse. Slip past the guard booths or find another guard. way. All right, guys, what's the plan for today? The plan is to do the ghost in it. Challenge? Achievement? Shit, I already forgot. I see a camera. It's the thing to do a pacifist. You can't kill nobody. <laughs> so yeah, you can't kill nobody, and also part of the challenge says that you can't, like, alert, or you can't take out the camera guard, which is kind of weird because pacifist already kind of implies that. Unless there's something I'm missing, and maybe there's a way you can get him without killing him. But yeah, essentially you can't kill nobody. I also thought I'd try to do uh, all loot, because don't you know how much fun I have moving bags for 30 minutes? You guys know I love it. Check out the guard. Nice. I'm sure that will prove useful. All right. Let's see, where are you? Guard over there. He's on the move. Go, 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 go. Guard. Eh, couldn't beat him. Watch the camera. Hey, there's a guard. Check out the guard. All right, buddy. Guard. Hey, there's a guard. So for the most part, I feel like 99 boxes is actually a fairly straightforward stealth mission. Nice. But, uh, yeah, it's just, it just mostly, you know, follow the objective, take your time, don't get baited <laughs> by, uh, you know, going too fast or, or doing something dumb, like getting caught sprinting in an area you shouldn't have been, stuff like that. And for this particular run, it's also going to be similar. So for all loot, it, it, it's just a lot of preparation. There's a lot of prep stuff I have to do. You'll, you'll see what I mean later. Great. Nice. We're gonna need that later. So one of the things I do want to say before we actually get to it is that for an all loot run, if you're planning on doing it yourself, Try to get all the optional loot before you get the main loot. Link. The components we're after start degrading as soon as they're at room temperature. Uh, we'll need a refrigerated truck to get them out of here. Find one. Then look for crates of liquid nitrogen to get it wait. nice and cool for transport. Nice. Got it before anyone saw me. But anyway, so if you're doing this on Overkill, Lead Guard has, you know, a really big pathing area. He, he patrols the whole map, essentially. Warehouse, back, front, sides. Now, the thing about this mission, though, is that he actually does change his pathing based on the objective. So, once I stick this container in here, which maybe I shouldn't do it just yet. I'm actually going to do something else first. I'm going to grab the zipline first. Guard over there. So once I stick that objective in there, the coolant, what he's going to do is he's actually going to change his pathing. He's not going to go all around the map like usual. What Check he's going to do is he's actually just going to stick in one area. And that area will depend on which shipyard you have. But if you have this shipyard, he will stay in this area. If you have on the other side, he will stay in that area right by the fence. Now, that does provide a bit of difficulty because there's a lot that can spot you there like so for me well i guess it's better to just show you but yeah the thing is he'll stick around this area and that uh that means it's hard to walk around there there's going to be three guards and one civilian and since i'm doing pacifist i can't kill any He's of the gone. guards and just the way it's like set up i can't really deal with that civilian not easily anyway Check out the guard. Yeah, his particular pathing for that civilian is right in front of cameras and is right in front of guards. There's like almost no way to actually get him. At least not that I found. Without first taking out a couple dudes. Just 
Just gonna unlock that. Not that I think I'll use it, but just in case. Guard over there. So yeah, once the lead guard's pathing changes, he'll stay there for a while, at least until you pick up the next objective, which is... Should I hack that camera? Maybe I should. Uh, maybe later, actually. It won't matter. Gotta get in, close the door, hack this before the guy comes back, because that guard that patrols up here, he'll see that computer being hacked, and he'll go all haywire. So yeah, make sure he's far away when you do it. I'm going to put this here. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to be hacking a lot of cameras, actually. I'm going to hack that one first. Yeah, let's just hack that one first. All right, we know where the components are, but we're going to need a refrigerated transport to get them out of here. Unlock that door. Nice. All right, so now maybe I can actually show you guys, but once I put in this liquid nitrogen, lead guard will go from wherever he was pathing on this map and go straight toward that area that I was talking about. So, making sure there's no guards around. There is a guard Check around. Out the guard. Hey, lead guard, guard, hey, speak of the devil. Literal devil, like he's, he's really quite annoying to deal with. All right, we'll find the components I can't to spot him. Guard over there. But you see, he's already leaving. He's leaving toward his spot. Hey, there's a guard. Yep. There's a guard. Yeah, so that's what happens. When you stick that in, he changes his pathing. And now what he's hey, gonna do is Ah oh, fuck. Can I get in and out in time? Nah. Nope, too slow. Oh, wait. So what he's going to do is he's going to stay over here because this is the shipyard side that I have to go to. That makes it more difficult to move bags. This guard. But that also means he doesn't move from that spot until you pick up the next objective, which is the main objective loot. So if you get all the side loot, you know, that just means, like, you don't have to worry about one extra lead guard in the warehouse, in the front, anywhere. All right. The components are in the west All right. Like um, anything else I have there. to do here before I Grab leave? No, I think that's it. Oh, yeah. Let's Let's it. it up. Check out the guard. You're not going to see me, are you? I do know that if the lead guard is right down here, he will see you. <laughs> You'll get insta-spotted. I see a camera. All right, so here we get to the prep stage. I'm going to try... There are three sieves and three guards. I'm going to try to get all the sieves down and out of the way. This guard. And then I'm also going to move all the secondary loot. Like I said, this is the best time to do it before you pick up the main objective. That's not the one. See if there's anything of value inside. Otherwise, keep looking for the components. And unfortunately, I am just going to ignore, like, the value of the main loot. Oops. Button. Yeah. When you when you sprint around and try to get as much value as you can from it, that's just asking to, to get failed. <laughs> it's just asking for a mission fail. So I, I honestly don't even bother. And if I take it slow anyway, I'm most likely getting the lowest value, so... It's better just to ignore all that nonsense. Just just do the mission as you would a normal stealth. <laughs> this guard. Guards are here. I'm gonna hack this camera. You don't see me. Yeah, so there's gonna be three sieves on the other side of this uh, configuration. We we. Unfortunately, one sieve comes onto this side, 
And there's not really a safe spot, so you have to put them, like, all the way in that corner over there. As you can see, these guards really come all the way over here. There's also two more sieves in there, but um, they don't come out here. And there's actually a pretty safe spot to get them. So I'm going to be doing that later. This guard. He started spotting me and didn't give me any rush? That sucks. Should I hack that one too for now? Yeah, maybe. Guard. Look out, the sieve. That sieve right there. That's the one that comes out on this side. Hey, there's a guard. Actually, I wonder if I should just hack this one. And then this one. Oh. <laughs> nope. Not this no, guard. Didn't get a chance. Uh, we'll deal with that when the time comes. When a more opportune time presents itself, rather. Oh, speaking of opportune time presenting itself. You have to be careful though. Check the sieve. Nope, sieve, okay. Yeah, there's there's a guard that comes around here too. So this is like the best way I've I've found of doing it. Ooh, that was close. Let's put you down for now. Oh no. Oh no. I think I think this corner is better when I do it later. Yeah, cuz what I'm want to do is gonna open this door. I don't want to risk it, because I, I was getting spotted by a guard there, and then he moved away. So he's over here somewhere now. That's the right there he is. Guard. Open it with the key I don't want him to walk in when I try to get that That's sieve. Unless, maybe now's okay. I won't say anything. Nice, perfect. Okay, good, 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 good. Yeah, now he's on the move. Good, 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 good. Oh, guard. there's a guy right there. Guard will stop exactly right there. I don't know if he will see this or not. Ooh. Check out the guard. <laughs> yep. Okay, we're we're good for now. Hey, there's a guard. But this is giving me the heebie-jeebies, so I'm just gonna move him. There we go. Still pacifist, see? We we's good, we's good. Oh, and he's gone, okay. Did I not? I did not even touch this thing. Okay, so that's two sieves down, and that's two loot bags acquired. Let's get the rest of them now. Well, can't move bags now. That guy will see a lot. Hey, there's a guard. Yeah, the little tippy top of his head is uh, <laughs> pretty annoying. So I gotta wait. This particular... Sorry, I'm stretching. <laughs> this particular configuration and this particular box uh, is uh, 
You'd think it'd be safer, because it's facing the back. No, there's, that guy back there will see so much. It's not even funny. He sees so much. Ooh. Check out the guard. Right, let's not do anything crazy here. You can tell I've done quite a few runs of this. Main problems being, I'm just, like, so impatient. <laughs> I just want to get it done. <laughs> Not to mention, I do occasionally try and do, like, okay, what if I put the sieves here? What if I put the sieves there? But, like, once I iron out, like, the details of what I want to do, it's more or less just execution, and execution is just a waiting game. That's solo still. You really just gotta do it slow, make sure you don't get spotted by anything, make sure you put bags in a safe spot, you know, that, that's really everything. So I can't actually touch that one yet. Now you may be wondering why I'm putting it there, because it's easily accessible there, and that's what's going to be important for later. I'm pretty sure nobody sees it. I've left it there a couple of times. It seems like a spot where people would see stuff, but I don't think anybody sees it. Well, we'll know, actually. Actually, now I'm kind of second-guessing myself. Well, e Let's just move it for now. Mm, fine, I'll just leave it. <laughs> okay. Oh, right, I forgot about that one. Thank you, Hoxon. That's useful. useful. One. So one, two, inside. three, four, Otherwise, five, six, and then the two the mission objective loot. That's all eight bags that you need to get for an all loot run. There's a guard. Guard there. Okay, he didn't see that one. Uh, so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to make two trips. One for these bags here, the optional loot. And then I'll come back, do the mission objectives, do all that stuff, then get the two mission bags out. I think that's what I'm going to do. Civilian. There's someone there. Yeah, if I can get that sieve, that'd be great, because that... Hacking that one, look at all those hack points. They're right where the sieve is, and he'll get spooked really easily. Oi! <laughs> there go my legs. I think I missed my chance, actually. I think, nope, 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 nope. It's a good thing I didn't go. <laughs> He's right there. I missed my chance. Guard. I forget. When you're not moving a bag, don't carry it on you. You get you just get guard. spotted faster, and there's no good reason for that. Uh, this could be a precarious position now, because there might be a guy coming this way. Oh, yep, there's something. Something was seeing me or a bag or something. This guard. Let's see who's that guy. Go away! <laughs> Still gotta wait. He's just gonna stop there. Uh, 
Ho hum. Guard. At least there's no guard here. I, there is a. Uh, there was one time where I had a guard here, a guard like down here somewhere, and a guard coming in here, and there's like this one safe spot, and it was just like right here. <laughs> Oh, yeah, there he is. Yeah, the stars had aligned in that particular scenario. For them, that is. <laughs> and I just couldn't do anything but sit in a corner. Sif. Hey, watch it. Guard. Guard over there. Let me see. I don't actually know if he's safe here. That's why I don't want to leave him here. Check out the guard. This guard. Good a time as any. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? You get spotted really fast when you have these guys. Camera's looking the other direction. Cool, cool, cool. All right. So that is most of the uh, which we call it the setup done. Now we just have to actually do the rest of the mission. Move the bags of money. Move the real. Objective loot, and then yeah. Oh man, that's a, that was loud. Sorry. What's that? Guard. Eat. <laughs> I know I'm not as bold as some people. Even I, like they wouldn't hear me from here, but when you sprint, you just get detected so easy. So I'm just, nah, <laughs> taking it easy. It's not worth it. Yeah, it's slow takes a lot of time, but yeah, it'd be how it is. Do I have all six bag here? I have to make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, okay. All right, now we have the more nerve-wracking section, which is guard over there. This right here. Check out the guard. Oh, perfect, nice. Okay, so that guy is in there right now. He's gonna come out in here and wait there, and then after that, he's gonna go somewhere around here, and that's what I want. Look out, the sieve. sieve. Where's lead guard? I know he's here somewhere. Guard. So yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these and just toss them in that little corner there. Once that guy is out of this area, it's pretty safe. Pretty safe. Hey, it's a I guard. also gotta wait for that guy to move though, because he's uh <sighs> spotting me quite a bit. This guard. Is he right under me right now? I don't see him. Guard over there. Where's that guy? Oof. All this fell. Guard. There's lead guard. I know you're in there. Too bad six cents isn't six sixth. Sense isn't in this game because there the it guard. is. I would just sit here, <laughs> let the spotting do the work for me. Hey, there's a guard. Check out the guard. Guard. 
at least for this particular RNG, I think this is the best way of doing it. I don't, I don't know if on the other side you can do a similar thing. This guard, guard over there. Check out the guard. Yeah, wait till he moves. Yeah, there we go. That is everything, right? Yeah. Oh, come on, game. <laughs> Moving it here for now because this is actually a safe spot. As long as you haven't picked up the uh, mission objective, lead guard will stay there. He won't go to the front, so he won't see it. And the side guard will not see those either because he just, yeah, he just won't see it. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Right. Public area. I can sprint. Still should be careful, though, because while sprinting and while holding a bag, they'll spot me super fast and with desync in this game, lag, whatever nonsense may be happening with the servers, yeah, you never know. You might get insta-spotted. That do hey, happen sometimes. Oh, he's coming in. Check out the guard. There he is. It's a good thing he doesn't stand on the side and he just kind of sits right there in the in the center. Oh, I guess I lied. There is one more setup thing that I have to do in this mission. There is one sieve in the front. Him and the lead guard will come over here once I pick up the mission objective. I'm also actually planning on bringing the mission objective all the way out here to the front like I am right now. Guard over there. Yeah, because if value is not an issue, I feel like, I feel like this is the safest area here because there's only going to be one lead guard. And he will only come out sporadically. So you do have to be careful, but... I mean, it's a lot better to be, you know, worrying about only one guy as opposed to, as opposed to <laughs> however many are in the warehouse right now. There's like the two, um, there's the, yeah, there's the two, one on the ground floor and one on the catwalk. And then the sieves, there's three of them, two static ones, so technically only two that I have to worry about. Actually, I'll just leave it here. Uh, I don't know, I'll be safe. But yeah, it's it's just it should be easier to deal out here. There is a little bit of a problem though. If you do get caught out here, there's not a lot of places to hide. Like in the uh in the warehouse at least you can hide behind a lot of stuff. They did a pretty good job designing like cover that you can get under and stuff. Out here though, there's only a couple of trucks and they don't provide a lot of good cover. So if you're like in the middle, and then you start getting spotted, then yeah, you might actually just get screwed over. I'm just putting it in there because I don't know if the lead guard actually shows up back there. He might see it, you know? It's better to be safe than sorry for these things. Speaking of safe and sorry... Oh, perfect. He was nice and close. <laughs> if you get too close, the side guards can see him, and the... There's also cameras there. You'll, you'll see what I mean when I get closer. Perfect. Alright, now all the setup's done. Now we have to do the mission. <laughs> be, you gotta be super careful, though. Hey, camera. Camera there. Camera there. Camera. Check out the guard. Okay, not gonna zip line yet. So 
that door. Guard over there. I like how when you highlight this guy, it doesn't highlight his hat, so it just looks so funny. <laughs> Guard. Check out the camera. Yeah, I have a feeling it has something to do with that jumping animation you do. That just makes hey, it so that you instantly get detected. And that's not very fun. Camera. Check out the guard. Where'd the other one go? Guard. Oh, there's two over there. Hey, Boy, no. Guard. Two right where all the objectives are. <laughs> you can't do anything about it. Right. Guard over there. Spot his little feetsies. Yeah, so. Uh, now that I've gotten rid of the Check other the sieves, this should be a lot easier, because now there's only three guys to worry about instead of six walking around, you know? Always good to try to watch your butt. I don't know if he does a 180 here. I don't think he does. Guard over there. Yeah, see, this L here is really sketch because, like, there's just not a lot of cover. And if you get sandwiched from two of them, which, you know, that's where their pathing goes, hey, a guard. then you're shit out of luck. So you got to make sure that they're not Check in that the particular part of their pathing where they're, like, walking together here. How the fuck is he seeing me? God damn it, I hate it when they do that turning nonsense. Hey, camera. Alright, I'm out of here. I don't like being here any longer. I hate these fucking circles, man. This is the stupidest goddamn objective I've ever done in my goddamn life. Uh, well, take the easy one. Maybe I'll get lucky and it'll spawn right behind me. No reason to work harder if I don't need to, right? <laughs> Damn it. Where are you? Where is he? Wait, there he is. Guard over there. Oh, and there he is. Okay, you know what? Time to GTFO. Let's just let them do their pathing and let them cross or whatever. Guard. Yeah, see, that, that's just like a no-go situation. You could be bold. You could try it. You might get away with it. You probably would, actually, considering Guard the time. There. Check out the guard. But I don't want to risk it. <laughs> okay, see, that time I vaulted it. What the fuck, game? Hey, there's a guard. Guard over there. Great, you're in. Remember, the hey, timer starts ticking as soon as you remove the components from its casing. Guard. Great pretty fast, so get it back to the guard. I'm moving away from you, fuck. <laughs> Still spotting me. And, of course, he stopped there. And, of course, homeboy is over there, too. So, I can't go that way. Can I go that way, actually? I don't remember if there's a thing over here I can climb up. Oh, there do. There do be. Doobie Brothers. Guard over there. 
guard over there. <laughs> you guys are not gonna like me doing this part. <laughs> Get the components to the truck. They've started to grade. Oh no, their value. Oh no. Oh no. Hey guys, it's 37 minutes in. Is this the run where I told you guys how I learned about how expensive this loop really is? <laughs> Same as before. Bypass container security and back the But yeah, the thing about the solo stealth is that you just don't want to run. You don't want to risk ruining an entire run simply because you wanted the, the value from this loot. And yeah, it is it is good, actually. Like, a friend was telling me that this particular mission has the most... Uh, most of the loot money comes from those two bags. That's it. Can I hack that? Okay. Close enough. This guard... Of course, it's those three. Yeah, but the thing is, if I'm taking it slow, even if I were seriously trying to get it back, and I duck walked all the way, I still probably wouldn't get any value from it, just because, you know, playing it safe means that that's just what happens. <laughs> so, there's no reason to actually bring it over now. I'm just going to leave it here. When I'm well and ready, I will take it over. That's, that's all there is. I don't... I think I hacked the same one. This guard. I don't remember if there's a safe spot down here that I can hide in, if there was someone there. I'm just gonna wait for this guy to go, honestly. Yeah, it's just, it's just not worth it. Yeah, not really. You can kind of hide behind here. Guard over there. He's gonna turn around here. I'm pretty sure. Check out the guard. Yep, he did. Wait. I like how when Payday Three came out with all the trailers and stuff. People said, rip, no no more hiding behind poles and stealth. Uh-huh. <laughs> Not much has changed, fellas. <laughs> Not much has changed. Vaulting is still, goddammit. There we go. Guard. <sighs> Use this time to stretch. Guys, I need a new chair. I'm too tall. The armrests on this one are too short and my shoulders keep hurting. It's no fun. It's honestly really no fun. Guard over there. I want to get like a used like Herman Miller or I think a steel case or something. But yeah, even the used ones are kind of expensive. Plus, maybe, I don't know. I don't use Facebook Marketplace or anything. I would have to go on sketchy Craigslist. Maybe I could ask my friend to help me find one on Facebook. It is my job, after all. Gotta place my, my butt in my seat. Check out the guard. Or perhaps I can try getting, like, a standing desk or something. But I don't know. This house has, like, an executive-style desk that just... This guard. Oh, lordy. It has an executive-style desk, and it was just always there. And it's really nicely made and stuff, and it looks nice, but... Yeah, that just means that you can't have, like, a standing modern desk with modern things. <laughs> you can't have nice holes or a nice stand or stuff. You gotta deal with the, the nice mahogany wood? I don't even know my woods. It's a nice wood, though. It looks nice. Should be the last one. I made it. <laughs> the components have started degrading. Secure them fast. OK, 
Okay, nobody there. Oh, good. Okay, good. It fell. If we want more than the bare minimum out of these things, oh, shit. get them secured. Check out the guard. It didn't fall. Watch the camera. Turn, please. Camera. Hey, there's a guard. Bleh. Then you can only have two hacked at a time. <laughs> you know, right now would be a good time to ask, I guess. Has anyone really have a, had a really good use of the ping camera? Oh, shit. Guard over there. The uh, route ping camera? Hey. Is a guard. I feel like that's less useful because it still spots people. Like, it's still a regular camera, but it does like highlight guards now. But I don't need it for that. I need, <laughs> I need something to not spot me. You know. <laughs> I feel like that's usually a bigger issue rather than just knowing where to where a guard is. Guard. Hey, there's a guard. Yeah, I, I think this is one of the uh, kind of inherent problems with. Uh, I guess just stealth missions in general. It's like you're supposed to learn the pathing and stuff, so you get a general idea of where a guard could be. Like, you know, I kind of understand that when this guy's here, that guy's there, so. So, like, the route ping doesn't really help me too much. I haven't seen a whole lot of use for it. Don't put it too close to the fence. For some reason, I think the guy on the other side might get t a tiny bit suspicious if he sees it. <laughs> it. It might be sticking through the fence or something. Ah. Hey, there's a guard. Ah. <laughs> there we go. Guard over there. This is good timing, actually. Yeah, so once he leaves, I can yoink. There's someone there. Alright, now I do have to be careful. There will be a lead guard somewhere around here. If this were Payday 2, I'd just ping the whole area, start like spamming ping, and hopefully I, I get a ping on him, but right now I don't see him. And with Payday 3, you can't do that, because you gotta... Yeah, you just do this. <laughs> it, it would obscure your vision. You know what I'm really hoping? I know a lot of people want, like... HUD mods and really, really interesting stuff like that. You know what I really want? I want a mod that just makes it so that the keybinds are back to what Payday 2 used to be. That's all. That's all. <laughs> like, I really miss having interact also be the button to spot stuff. That was a fine system. It was fine. There was nothing wrong with it. And yeah, maybe like they could add like a way to ping stuff, and then that's it. This guard. Oh shit! Lead guard is here. Guard. I'm trying to wait to get a spot on him because lead guard will actually come this way. And this is the way I gotta go to get in. Guard over there. There we go. Yeah, so I have to make sure I know which way he's going. Great work, people. Halfway done. Get back to the storage yard and secure the second device. Yeah, so this is sacrilege as far as payday standards go, because I'm just letting these loots 
deteriorate so much in value and stuff, but this is the best way I've found to do it. <laughs> Besides, money is almost useless. I mean, the only use it really has right now is buying C stacks. Let's be totally honest. <laughs> money doesn't get you EXP. Buying mods for weapons is already pretty cheap. You know, you don't gotta worry that much about it. It's really just the C stacks. Guard. There's a guard. Make sure no lead guard. Hey, oh there's shit. A guard. <laughs> oh shit. What was that noise? We have it. That's what we came for. Check out the guard. Check for any additional valuables as a bonus. There's a guard. Otherwise, secure the cool truck and get it ready to roll. Hey, it's a guard. Guard over there. All right, there he is. So now, Check now he's out guard. here. He doesn't come back up, does he? If he does, I'm screwed. <laughs> I'm gonna have to do that again. Throwing knives are really useful in stealth. Good distraction. I think one of the stealth skills I want to pick up next is that one where, when you throw a throwing knife, or when you throw a throwable, actually, it's not just throwing knives. When you throw a throwable, hey, you guard. have a chance of not consuming it is like a 20% chance or something or well I guess it's the same as Go not consuming there. is the same as you know getting it back but uh, <laughs> you basically you get a 20% chance to get another one back <laughs> and I think that that's what I want to pick up next because that is really useful you saw that right there it just saved my ass let me grab all that extra loot he's still way over there Check out the guard. You gotta be careful though. I don't want to be sprinting while both those guys are like seeing me. But now I think essence of speed is important here because they're just away. You know, just gotta make sure I get it while they're away. Too bad this sieve on the ground isn't giving me a rush. Nice. I think that's all the loot. Yeah? Alright, guys. Now I'm gonna do this for a little while. Nah, I'm fucking with you guys. I'm not gonna do that. Why would I do that? What do you guys take me for? Some filthy... Some filthy... Farmer? No, I would never. Never. Well... Actually, I say that, but right after this, I'm just going to go and farm starfish, and i got to go hunt a bunch of crabs. Anyway, um, yeah, there's all the loot. <laughs> Fun. How long did that take? Oh, dear God, 50 minutes. Do you guys really like seeing this kind of stuff? This was so boring to me. <laughs> well, I hope you had fun, because I didn't. <laughs> Moving so many bags is not fun. <laughs>